Hello Libra, this is Sage Sunset. Welcome into my channel. Thank you so much for being here. I hope that while you're here, Libra, you'll find messages that are able to guide you along your journey. So I'm using the tarot cards here to provide you intuitively interpreted messages for your journey ahead. Um, Libra, let's get started with your reading. Some of you could be starting new business, a new enterprise setting up um establishing a new creative idea turning it into a business and watching it like putting that effort and energy into it that intention putting um your focus and your attention in this business this could be something that you love this could be a, a business or this could be a romantic relationship for some of you just start, start starting something brand new libra okay libra so your first card i feel like some of you could be really prospering in business or in love this is the card of marriage of union of the two of souls two soulmate energies coming together we see that reflected over here in the two of hearts card from the playing card deck this could be just the flourishing of a business also i feel like for some of you this could be the desire to set up a business i did say earlier that there's a new business oh look at this there's a new business being established for some people here new ideas new creative ideas coming into play maybe for some of you just for the first time setting up just whatever you're good at doing i feel like you may be deciding to really use it as a profession and it is coming through there's a reason to celebrate so this is either in business or in love Maybe there's a feeling of loss, maybe a, of hopelessness to some degree of not knowing where to turn, what to do to really get this business started, what to do to really get this relationship going. Um, but there is healing coming into you in balance. So find balance, find a way to find a way to um, find a way that where there is equal give and take in the situation to ensure that you'll be secure in business, you'll be making profits. If this is a relationship. I feel like heal so that you both can really come together well and be the best of yourselves in this relationship going forward. Mm. So someone might have wanted to really steal away something from you, Libra. Are this this could be you going off into that place where you can find healing. Maybe taking what you need, moving swiftly, actually, to really build your dreams. Build the life that you wish to, to live, to celebrate this life. So moving toward that life earnestly. So this could really be you really get in the phase of setting up this business, establishing the foundations of it, ensuring that everything is going to be running smoothly, putting in the necessary investments that you need, whether it's work, whether it's labor or financial investment into your business, spreading actually word of your business's development to friends, to family, also confidently just going ahead going ahead knowing that you have what it takes to actually start this business you do have the gift of what you, of discernment here um and imagination to really know how to move forward what steps you need to take what offers to refuse um guided in heart even to work with your heart we have two fours here on the board you could be working from home some of you setting up your business online uh this business could have to do with aesthetics uh, beauty healing well-being transformation Well, for some of you, you're moving past disappointment. Um, so this energy, some of you may have gone through heartbreak in the past or some kind of a letdown um, of a situation where you were involved with another person or another business idea that didn't really pan, pan out um, as you wanted it to. So they, that may have caused you to really have doubts about your business. To really maybe that's what you need healing from really to find balance to make sure that the business that you're setting up in the future is going to be safe and reliable is going to actually bring profits 
into your into your life not to waste your time setting up all the foundation and then in the end not being sure that the return is going to be favorable enough for you so there may have been some delay in the business prospering you know showing its fruitfulness to you and so it may have caught it may have disheartened you if this is a relationship reading for some people here you could be a broken heart where you were put in a third party situation and your mar it, with, which interfered with your marriage or with your soulmate connection here and that's what caused you to want healing maybe some of you moved away or like separated yourself from this this situation so that you can go toward finding healing and actually dreaming again and feeling good again finding groundedness and stability in your heart space the three of swords also for me represents aligning aligning with your sense of stability building foundations in your heart your integrities your virtues knowing what to allow in your life and what to remove from your life so there are some things that need to be removed it could be energies some disruptive energies that came your way um should be taken away and um so the, now you're more emotionally intelligent knowing what to let in your life and what not to okay hmm some of you could be really healing or really maturing emotionally here this is amazing Moving into a place where you are liberating yourself, setting up your business. This could be a water sign, water sign energy coming into you here. Um, could be a relationship that you're moving into with a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio. Or uh, this could be the person that you're moving away from that caused you heartache or business partnership that didn't work out for you. But I feel like this is what you're moving toward. It's either a fulfilling relationship because we do have the two of cups over here, the two of hearts. That does represent a water sign as well. But it is here standing out more powerfully as if you're going to be aligning with a water sign. This could be romantically or in business, establishing your business, feeling good, feeling secure, having the mental space and clarity to know how you're going forward because I feel like you did take the necessary steps, Libra, to make sure that your business is secure, copyrighted and everything so that no, no one can come in and um, take what it is that you have worked so hard to establish for yourself. I also see where Hmm. Yes. Oh, wow. The Ten of Cups. So your business could be something that you're really, that's, that's creative in, you know, very creative something that you're doing and you're setting up your business in it. You feel so good. I feel like you have a family that you're happy about. Um, prosperity coming into your life this could be with a water sign again cancer pisces or scorpio you could have children with this person looking to get married this person is looking to you feeling good as well maybe you had to either move away from your home life a little bit to really get clarity to establish your business you know put yourself first a bit librans so that you can really start your business for some of you really moving into this life of fulfillment, completeness, where you have your businesses, your home, your family, the land of your desire, and your true partner. This could be uh, yeah, an energy between you, Libra, and a water sign here. Just complete, just fulfillment, fulfillment, new beginnings of fulfillment here coming through for you. Just being so happy, everything working out for you. This person is someone that is very prominent in your life. This water sign energy. Hmm. All right then. Wow, I feel like there's a lot of healing coming into your space. Healing, transformation, well-being coming into you. Not just you, but your entire family. Fruitfulness. Like, um being moderate knowing when to give and when to take 
balancing energies and emotions becoming clear of what you want out of this life the direction for you and your partner you guys could be just doing things together these days going out starting a garden here um, going to the water together where you can find healing and balance we have two very prominent healing water cards here which is saying I feel stay hydrated and find healing healing some of you may need to to really rejuvenate and heal especially through water divination here look to your higher nature i feel like you guys are also praying being contemplative of how to really move forward i feel like there's a lot of strength and power here within this reading hmm. for so, some of you may feel like the work that you're putting in may not prove to be fruitful as if it may not turn out good maybe you kind of have a um, con confidence issue not being confident about the business that you're setting up or your relationship as if you may not have the energy to make it work or you know you might fear that it might not work out for you and I feel like there's energy being invested into this relationship or this business But at the end of the day, I feel like you should have confidence because you are establishing, putting in the the, the necessary, what the necessary things that needs to be established in your business. They are being, they are being built. You are healing. You are overcoming and becoming more mature. You are dreaming of the life that you want, and it's manifesting here with the Ten of Cups energy. You love the, the idea of your family and your home life here. It's beautiful. So just continue dreaming, wishing, creating the life that you desire. And I feel like it will actually turn out in your favor. New beginnings. The death card here. I feel like... Um, so the death can be an ending or a new beginning. I feel like it may be the something may come through to you which reveals an answer that you've been looking for that maybe puts an end to worry or fear that a situation may not work out for you and it will bring through clarity and a sense of enthusiasm for you to proceed either in this relationship that you're in libra or this business that you're starting so i feel like you you had some fears here standing up and it's going to be leaving as if just exiting your life the fears so that you can proceed proceed with developing manifesting the life that you truly want to live we have the six of cups energy at the bottom of the deck here which is true love love established in oneself that is reflected on the outside and so you are attracting this love and this is also a water card so for many Libras your person is Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Okay. All right, Libra. Thank you so much for being here. Just keep focusing on your business. You have love here. You have creativity, business development. You have you using your creative ideas, your creative genius, your focus to start a business that is actually going to be prosperous for you. All right, Libra, thank you so much. It's going to bring in financial, new beginnings of financial stability for you. Right? <clears throat> Libra, thank you so much for being here. And I hope you find messages in this reading that are helpful. And if you did, please give my video a thumbs up and a subscribe to my channel for future uploads. All right? Thank you so much. Much appreciated. Libra, remember... You can be, do, have anything and everything in this world that you desire. Dream big because you are all, all is within you. Take care. Much love.